All right, hi, and welcome back. Attorney Steve Vondren here. We are talking in this episode about depositions and Governor Newsom order. Okay, so um, one thing I'm seeing in the litigation trenches right now is basically opposing counsels who are thinking that you don't have a right to take an oral deposition. Okay, saying, well, look at the Code of Civil Procedure. Uh, it's not in there, this, that, and the other. But I want to point you to an emergency executive order on judicial council authority. Judicial council, say that five times fast. Judicial council emergency authority issued by Governor Newsom. And it talks about here now, this was just a couple days ago, about a week or so ago. Um, the governor signed an executive order to enhance the authority of California's judicial branch. Okay, that's the courts. Okay, three branches of governments, right? Legislative, executive, judicial, that's the courts. Specifically, the executive order empowers judi the judicial council and the chief justice of the California Supreme Court to take the necessary action to be able to conduct business and to continue to oper operate while responding to the COVID-19 pandemic. Um, the order does not affect any existing court order or rule. Here it is. And this is important because some attorneys I see are balking at it and they're thinking, well, you know, we don't have to agree to that. Here's what it says. The order allows the judicial branch to allow for remote depositions. Let me say it again. Allow for remote depositions in every case. The law had previously required that the parties be deposed in person. Usually you show up, you sit at a table as a court porter. Um, but this allows you to do this deposition remotely, okay? Additionally, the order leaves the judicial branch the discretion to make any modifications to legal practice and procedure it deems necessary in order to continue conducting business. So the courts are going to have some wide leeway here, okay? So, you know, depositions can be set for remote using Zoom, WebEx, GoToMeeting, whatever the case may be. But it says here, our courts need to continue to do their business for the sake of the law and public safety and to the extent they are able to. And it is my responsibility to do everything I can to give the judicial counsel and the chief justice the flexibility they need to take actions to meet this moment. So there it is, folks. Um, so yes, oral the depositions remotely are possible. Okay. So there you have it. Have a great day. Be safe. And um, if you need some more help, you can find us. You got a issue at hand, civil litigation, attorneysteve.com. That's attorneysteve.com. The first name in legal services. Have a great day now. Be safe.